continue our Iditarod coverage now for the Iditarod Area School District. Teachers are finding new ways to keep the area's long tradition of dog mushing alive. Channel 2's Travis Ketchatorian reports on a unique class that is taught to the students that some might consider job training. Pay close attention. They're going to be coming uh, right through the trees, right through that trail. Because class is about to begin. We'll see you in a second. As a team of sled dogs comes barreling down the trail, students cheer on a familiar face learning commands from the back. Push out. Good job. Good job, Kendra. Eighth grader Kendra Chase is learning how to take up the reins in a unique program you'll only find in rural Alaska. Uh, the kids are getting an opportunity to ride in a back sled and that gives them the, the, the understanding of stability and um, so that when they become drivers themselves, they'll have experience what it's like to correct. And uh, this is the, the first start of that, that process. And they learn a lot about uh, responsibility. You know, when you got 22 dogs, you don't have a day off. For most of the students, mushing class teaches them about their community's roots. But for a select few, it prepares them for a potential career as a racer or a dog handler. If they want to actually like run dogs when they get older, have a big team, run that deer ride, it's a good experience. For today's lesson, there are no blank stares or glazed over eyes. Cute! The children are genuinely engaged, whether it be those just in it for the dogs. I love dogs, they're my favorite animal. Or those like Chase, the future oh, mushers God. of America. Reporting in McGrath, Travis Ketchatorian, Channel 2 News. Well, of course, the weather can be one of the biggest challenges facing a Diderot team.